It's not that I don't like the Porsche 911. I just didn't grow up fawning over it. It's an impressive bit of automotive engineering. It's been a successful machine since its introduction in 1963, and it has fans all over the globe. Still, it's never been to me what it is to many others. The truth of the matter here is that I've actually never driven a 911, but that changes today. So we've found somebody foolish enough to let me drive their Porsche. John, thanks for coming out. What are we dealing with here? Chassis wise, it's a 1970 Porsche 911T. It's been at this point, essentially a family heirloom for 25 plus years. It sat in storage. They eventually decided to put it all back together. Now, did you put it back together as it was in the 70s? The motor that was in it was a 2.5 liter twin plug race motor built by Wayne Baker back in the day. And okay. to try to rebuild it today, uh, just, didn't have the financial means to do it. Sure, it, Porsche, I, expensive. Yeah, That's what they call it. the Porsche tax. <laughs> so I decided to part out that motor and use the equity of parts to fund the rebuild of the car. A smart man. Yes. Uh, so what's in here now? A motor from a 1985 uh, Porsche 911, 3.2 liter in it. Came out of a track car, has mild work. The dyno sheet I got said 220 at the wheels. That's pretty good. And I mean, this can't weigh much. My assumption based off all the work that's been done to it is sub 2,200 pounds. That's excellent. So power to weight wise, it, it scoots pretty well. That's pretty awesome. I got to thank you for bringing this out here. I don't get the cult of 911. I get that people love it. I've just, I've never driven one. Maybe I'm missing out. So right now I'm going to do that real cliche automotive show thing where they ask for the keys. Would you mind if I took your keys? Mostly I've learned that I've been incredibly wrong about 9-11s from the get-go. I knew they were fun, I didn't know they were this fun, and now I've learned a whole lot more. Thankfully, I didn't even turn into a dentist, which was one of my fears. What's worse though, is I want one of these now, and that's gonna be a problem. 